Unit 4. Vocabulary. 2. Strong Adjectives. Look at the following extracts from the text on pages 42 and 43. What do the adjectives in bold mean? Extracts means few sentences taken from a longer passage. We were exhausted because we'd been hiking through mountainous terrain for eight hours. Exhausted means very tired. We were so delighted with our find. We were so happy. Very pleased, very happy. Now look. Exhausted and delighted are strong adjectives. We can also call them non-gradable adjectives. Tired and pleased are gradable adjectives. What is the difference between gradable and non-gradable? The difference is that you can use very with gradable adjectives, but you can't do that with strong adjectives. You can't say very exhausted no very tired yes okay is it easy you can say really tired extremely tired very tired quiet tired a bit tired is there a difference between them yes extremely is a very strong word very is not that strong quiet even weaker a bit means very little I am not very tired, I am a little tired. With strong adjectives, you can use really. Notice that we have really here and there, really. But you can't use the other adverbs. With non-gradable adjectives, we use absolutely, completely, and utterly. What does utterly mean? It means completely. It means absolutely the same thing. Is there a difference between the three? No. So today's vocabulary is very easy. Now, replace the strong adjectives in sentences 1 to 10 with very or extremely and the adjectives in the box. Change furious and write very angry or extremely angry. Scared, small, big, bad, silly which means stupid or childish, interesting, tasty, unpleasant. If something is unpleasant, it makes you unhappy. It is repulsive or important. 1. Imad was furious when he discovered, when he found out that Alex had borrowed his new car. When you borrow something, you take it and use it and then give it back after a short period of time. But the problem is that he didn't take Imad's permission. Permission means Imad didn't say yes, okay, take my car. He took it behind his back. So Imad was furious. He was very angry. You can write very angry or extremely angry. Two. Kevin owns, has, an enormous house in the countryside, away from the city, with more than 20 rooms in his house. The house is enormous, it is very big, extremely big. Everybody started laughing when Luke walked in wearing a ridiculous hat. His hat was stupid, silly. It is essential that you wear safety glasses when doing this experiment. Experiment, scientific test. Wear glasses to protect your eyes. It is essential, it is very important to do that. I saw tiny insects, insects like ants and roaches, crawling. Crawling is for insects, we don't say walking. We say crawling all over the walls of the building. Tiny insects, very small. 
Bugs. Leila made a delicious chicken pie last night. It was delicious. It was tasty. Our hotel bathroom was disgusting. It was dirty and there were cockroaches crawling all over the floor. These are cockroaches. It was disgusting. It was unpleasant. It was awful. That book was awful. The plot was stupid and the ending was very bad. The plot, the story, the events in the book. The book was awful. It was very bad. I studied archaeology because I find it fascinating. Archaeology is the history of mankind, ancient civilizations. It is fascinating. It is very interesting to me. Nadia was terrified when she went bungee jumping. What is bungee jumping? It is what you see in the picture. She was terrified, very scared. Thank you for watching this video. If you like it, please share it with friends. I'll see you again next time, inshallah. Goodbye.